Okay, continuing in the series of uh, restaurants, entertainment venues and accommodations around uh, Cha'am. Uh, this first one in this uh, particular video is The Lounge. The Lounge Cafe and Sports Bar. Not a girly bar. This is a good place to come with your family, your girlfriend, your wife. Uh, open from early morning for breakfast and uh, uh, other meals, lunch, dinner. Uh, quite often have entertainment, have um, darts competitions, have uh, a jam session night, open mic night. There's Dave, a proprietor of this uh, particular place. Uh, they have a lot of uh, big screen TVs, they do a lot of the sports stuff, especially uh, English football, etc, etc. Uh, they do some rugby league, I'm not sure they do cricket, but uh, yeah. So you want to watch sports, uh, this is where you come and have a beer and uh, watch your sport events. This is uh, an evening uh, that was uh, a birthday party of a uh, very good friend and neighbours of ours here. Uh, Tanya, it was her birthday, um, everyone had a great night, um, food for the evening uh, was uh, pizzas and uh, some Thai food too, I think, if I remember correctly, I don't know, I had a few beers that night, everyone had a few beers and uh, this particular evening, as I said, was just a birthday party for someone. Uh, a local person, a lot of people do this venue for birthday parties, etc. Uh, it's a really good place to come and have a nice relaxing time. There's no uh, wild times here, although it does get pretty uh, vibrant. Quite a few locals here, the guy playing music there was uh, fantastic. I think he was from Phuket. Everyone's having a good time. The girls were up dancing, have a good time. and. Uh, our particular table's right down at the end there in the corner. Everyone's there, of course. There's uh, Rob, Steve, B. Yep, so hooking into the pizza and the Chang. And uh, everyone very fond of a Chang beer. Yeah, so that's the lounge. That's another place uh, off the uh, list now that I've got to do. I've still got a quite a few to do. And, and you know it's taken me a bit of a while i've been a bit busy yeah now the next one is the cha um, perfect house now this hotel is uh, a really exceptionally good uh, by all accounts exceptional good economy hotel rooms go from four to five hundred to six hundred something like that every, a night it's been a bit cheaper of course with covid i think the rooms in the front are 500 a night, five or 600 a night. The rooms at the back are like 400 a night at the moment, something like that. Those prices will differ as things uh, get busier, I guess. Uh, by all accounts, and I know quite a few people who uh, stay at this place, it's right opposite our shop, the Billabong Aussie Diner, and a lot of the uh, customers from this hotel come to uh, our cafe uh, to have a feed and I've never heard a bad report everyone speaks glowingly of it so yeah and there's a lot of people come there on the weekends from uh, other provinces you know Bangkok, uh, Kanchanaburi, Prachap Kirikan people visiting Cha'an for a few days or a week or so some even for a month or so stay in this place uh, exceptionally good it's very clean very tidy simple but uh, all the rooms uh, are very, very clean. Uh, there's plenty of storage space. They have uh, good bathrooms. There's uh, air con in the rooms. And uh, all in all, from all reports, I've never stayed there myself, uh, from all reports, uh, a very good place to stay and very economical. Um, as you can see, the bathrooms are really nice, clean. Um, yeah, it's a good place. And uh, the landlady uh, from my shop owns this particular hotel and she's a really lovely person, as are all the staff that work there. The staff there are fantastic people. 
and uh, I'm pretty sure that uh, every floor, every uh, room has uh, free Wi-Fi. Saw the you know, routers on every floor. Uh, the last room was a back room. This room is a front room. As you can see, it's got it's a little bit bigger. This room, it's got a double wardrobe, so plenty of storage space. Uh, you know, you've got uh, the satellite TV. Uh, you've got uh, double beds, queen size beds. You've got your, um, I think the coffee making facilities are downstairs in the foyer but you know you've got your uh, bar fridge there that you can put your beer or whatever in these particular front rooms uh, uh, have uh, a balcony so I'll open up now and have a look at the balcony balcony faces the main street the uh, bus station road um, yeah so uh, it's right in the middle of um, entertainment area so this is a really pl close place if you want good food of course the Billabong Aussie Diner is in this street and of course there's a heap of entertainment areas there's bars there's la the lounge uh, there's uh, many many places it's right in the hub of the entertainment area really handy walking distance to the beach I would say two minutes a minute to two minutes walk down to Cha'am Beach. As I said before, all the bathrooms are exceptionally clean. Hot water systems, if you want hot water in Thailand, hot water systems, uh, instant hot water in, in all the bathrooms. And uh, all in all, a really fantastic place to, stay, place to stay, according to all reports of people I know that have stayed there. And uh, I know personally the staff there and the owner of the hotel, and they're all fantastic people, and I can't imagine anyone would ever complain about this place. A really nice place, it's called Cha Am Perfect House, and uh, I'll put the phone number and any other details of both of these places, Facebook pages, etc., in the info under the video. Hope you enjoyed this little one. There'll be another one coming up soon. I've got to get around to a few more cafes and a few more bars and a few more accommodations. Enjoy.